Hello, my YouTube family. I'm trying to keep it together, people. I am trying to keep it together. It is 4.34. And guess what's not getting done again this week and this weekend? I called her up at 12 noon and asked her, would she be available to get my hair done today? Oh, sure, um, but I won't be out for my up uh, my first job until after three. I said, okay, no problem. Um, so I'll just wait until you call me back. Okay, I'll call you back. So she got out of her first job. Then she gets to the house where she, she does hair, but the house of the woman that was sick. All this time, I thought she had a key to the house. She been she she works there every single day. I don't see what the problem is. Three thirty, quarter to four, four o'clock. No phone call. Four o five. Um, I'm trying to get somebody to open the door for me because nobody seems to be home. I'm texting. I'm. So, you know, now I'm about, I'm about, I, I've just about had it. So I let 15, 20 minutes go by. I called her back and I said, um, you know what? I can't make it because, uh, my father's car broke down. He just called me and I have to go pick him up. I can't. I can't at this point. You remember two weeks ago, I, I drove there. I didn't even call her because normally she's supposed to be there at least by three. At three o'clock, she wasn't there. This week, she can't even get to the house, get inside the house. And nobody's picking up the phone. Nobody's texting her back. Nobody. And right now it's 436. So, and it's getting dark outside. And my father's home and he is home. Nothing wrong with his car. He's home. I just had to make up some excuse because I can't. I, it's getting to the point now where I'm really sadly but truly thinking of maybe somebody else has to get my hair done like i have to go to somewhere else to get my hair done so at least you know early in the morning i could go i could get my hair done and be done with it and call it a day but i'm so loyal to these two women because i literally grew up with them and nobody knows my hair more than they do and i don't think with everything that they do to my hair, if somebody else were to do it, I would be charged 10 times more. So there's a lot to consider, but there's also a lot to, to have to deal with. So I have to weigh, is it worth dealing with it and pay more, or do I just stick it out? Or maybe try to go sometime during the week or something on a Friday night. Because I think she does hair on Friday night also. I think that's what I'm going to have to do from now on. Because I'll just go from work. I don't care how tired I am. Just go get my hair done and be done with it. And then I won't have to worry about it during the weekend. I think that's, I think that's really what I'm going to have to do. Now, you all know that I wanted to get my hair done because on Monday is Ben Affleck Day. Well, I'm going to have to come up with something. And you can see the grades are starting to starting to peek out again, right? So I'm going to just have to do a little side thing and cover up the grays. I wanted to avoid all of this, people. But okay, so I got that out my way. I got that off my chest. I vented. Thank you. But what I really wanted to talk to you about was uh, the other half of my mini haul from yesterday has arrived today. Plus, Sarah... The lipsticks, uh, S with an S, two, she, she, she sent me two, have arrived. Plus other lipsticks as well. So, um, God help me. No, actually it's just the two lipsticks. Because what I, what I have in the bag or what I already showed you yesterday. But here are the two lipsticks that Sarah sent to me. In this packet, by the way. 
I just happen to dump everything in it so I can just keep a tab of what needs to be reviewed and what doesn't because you know I can't keep things in the basket no more mm -hmm. woke me up at 5.30 in the morning people 5.30 in the morning and so now he gets to catch up on some more Z's and I have you know the rest of whatever I have to do so here are the two lippies that Sarah gave to me. Everybody in God's creation on YouTube have made reviews of these. One is a lilac. I think they're both lilacs. Ooh, look at that. Yes. The, they're the, both the glossy ones. One is called, it's shiny full coverage lip color. And this one is called, hold on now. There's got to be a name for it somewhere. Um, hmm. This is quite interesting. They don't have... Oh, on the bottom. Damn, Nancy. Okay. Uh, Lacquerized is this one. It's the pink one. This pink one right here. And this red one is... Laconic, Lacconic. This red one. This red one. Now they are packaged, so if you're willing to wait with me. Oh Lord Jesus, I should have done this before. Okay, you know what, people? Y'all just gonna have to wait. Ah! Y'all gonna have to wait for me to wear these and then review them because it would just take way too long. And I've got other things to show you that I that came. So finally, my other hard candy blush came. Yes, it did. This one is Living Doll. The other one yesterday was Bombshell, and this is Living Doll. So, and it's a bright pink too. Look, look at this. It's a bright pink. Nice. Very, very nice. With touches of yellow, kind of yellow gold. And I'm going to swatch. I'll try to make a deeper swatch than I did yesterday. Here we go. That. It looks like it might be able to be a highlight for me. But I'm going to see what I can do with it. It's a real bright pink. It's a real bright pink. Like a baby doll pink. There you go. So we shall see. This, I'll just, it's the packaging. I can't help it. Even if I don't like the product, the packaging is the ish. I can't help it. Next is my Physician's Formula Happy Booster. Now, you know in CVS and Dwayne Reed, this is like $14 or what have you. Amazon, this was for like $8.99. I wasn't going to pass that up. $8.99, people. And this is in warm. I'm trying to open it. Get it out. There we go. This is what it looks like. It just looks so beautiful. Oh my goodness. Here we go. Physicians formula. This is in warm. And this is what it looks like. And yes, I will do a swatch with this as well. Oh God, it's so soft. Oh my goodness, it is so soft. And this is it on top. It's like a, a deeper pink. It's like a peachy pink. Very nice. Very, very nice. So I am going to have fun with this. I, I think it could be used as an all over face powder or just a cheek blush. I'm going to use it as a cheek blush. Look at those colors. And when you blend them together, they just come out as a nice, soft, peachy pink. I may even wear this on Monday. Who knows? Is that rain I hear on my AC? Well, maybe it is a good thing I didn't get my hair done today. Who knows? Okay. Next. 
I've been wanting these brushes, people. People. I have been wanting these brushes for far too long. And I finally got my Real Techniques brushes. So now, not only do I have my e.l.f. brush, I have two Real Technique brushes. I've been wanting Real Technique brushes. Monica the Return Queen is the one that turns me on to Real Technique brushes. She said these brushes are the ish and they make your makeup look so wonderful. And I had no idea that these brushes were from um, by Samantha Champ Chapman. I had no idea. Not that I really know who Samantha Chapman is, but I know her name. So yes, yes, yes. This is a powder brush. And look at this brush, people. Oh my goodness. I love big, fat, dome-like, dense brushes. Oh my God. Soft to the touch. Soft to the touch. Love it. Oh. Mm. Mm. Absolutely. Absolutely. Love, 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 love. And the other brush is an expert face brush. High definition results on your base flawless brush. I think this could be used for cream foundations or liquid foundations. Um, my expert brush is ultra firm and broad for application and blending of cream or liquid foundation. Look pixel perfect even in harsh light. Ultra plush tap on bristles. Love it. Yes, people. Dense. I'm going to probably use this one for my um, under eye concealer. Yes. Yes. What? I have real technique brushes, people. So... That's, that's it. That is it. I have no more orders waiting in the wings. Everything has arrived. Everything is copacetic. Everything is here. Let me put my Happy Booster Physician's Formula away. I was originally going to do this video on Monday, along with the regular, you know, lips of the day and tell you about Ben Affleck. But you know that that video would have been 20 or some odd half an hour long. So since I needed to vent because of the hair, I figured let me just do the video today. As you can see, it is a no makeup day, honey. Weekends are no makeup days. So you see the dark under eye circles. You see it all. This is all me, fresh as a daisy. Just simply no makeup whatsoever. So that is it, people. That is all I have to tell you. Um, short, sweet, to the point. And um, yeah, that, that's, that's basically it in a nutshell. I'm going to try to <sighs> sigh. Just calm down, Nancy. Just calm down. But this has been going on for far too long. Y'all know this. Y'all know this. this. This is no way to run a business at all whatsoever. Like, at this point, if she's going to have clients coming in, she won't be closing up shop until 10, 11 o'clock at night. I'm not. That's not me. That is not me. I know for certain circumstances, things can get out of other people's control. I get it. But shouldn't you do something to at least alleviate the problem? It's getting later and later and later that she's starting to do people's hair and you know I'm at a point in my at in my age that my energy is highest in the morning I wanna do things in the morning I wanna get things out the way I wanna do my housework I wanna get my hair done I wanna in the morning and then as the afternoon comes down so does my body it just comes down it comes down and then after a while it's like whew I don't wanna go anywhere anymore that's around the three three o'clock three, four o'clock, five o'clock. 
that's when I'm 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 a homebody and I want to stay home and I want to watch TV and I want to play with my cat and I want to just talk to pop on Saturdays and I just that's it because at 6 is when pop and I usually do our Saturday night dinner if I had to go get my hair done at 5 the poor thing, my, I would either have to tell my father, go and have dinner by yourself, and I'll just pick something up on the way to come back. Because by the time I would have gotten my hair done, it would have been 8, 9 o'clock, walking out. No. No. So, I just need to, I, I need to bring it back. I need to bring it back. And I am seriously considering, like, weighing the options of, which is best? Which is best? Should I stay or should I go? But then there's all money involved and, and loyalty and and I'm one for I am all about being loyal to somebody that's been good to me for X amount of years. But at the same time, I don't want to be taken advantage of either. So, you know, just because don't think that I'm just gonna be keep waiting, keep waiting, keep waiting. And then at six six thirty, you're talking about oh, you can come over now and get your hair done. Six six thirty, for real. So maybe I should just find somebody else, like a plan B, in case I really do need to get my hair done that day, and she can't do it for me. Then then I have to find a plan B to go to the other place. And now I have to go look for that. So. We shall see. We shall see. On that note, people, um, thank you for letting me vent and let me know what you think about my products. And, um, yeah, I will, you know, I'm sure all of you guys know what these look like anyway by now. But, um, yeah, when I wear them, then you'll see. And then I'll do a swatch because trying to take off the plastic and all of that now. You see, I'm very irritated and very aggravated. So that's it for now. And that's all. I love you. I love my YouTube family. I know this was kind of like a surprise video, but I needed to vent to people. And I know that my YouTube family can deal with it. They can handle it. You all can handle it. Plus, I had to show you my goodies. That still came. And that is it. That was that, That's all of my Amazoning. For now. Because you know November is a different month. And I do have up days coming off. Just letting y'all know. Okay, you know I love you. I love my YouTube family. Hit me up. Let me know what you think. And I will talk to you on Monday. Okay? Bye now.